guys, we're gonna do another one just to show you guys. <laughs> Decision taking the exit out to was W to go drifted. Um, not sure what to expect with the RX8. It does have angle kit, it does have BC coilovers. The e brake is pretty good on it, so we're just gonna see what the car does. Not get too crazy with it coming today, it's still a daily, and I don't want to be thrown against the wall. So, right now, I have the backup following us. You can kind of see it back there, carrying the tools because. I'm not putting no jack. I'm not putting no no wheels and all that in this RX8 because this thing is really nice in the interior. So I have everything in the back of the Lexus. And we're about to just go uh, test the car out. We got, we're gonna meet Aiden there. He has the FC out again over there. I'm trying to basically dial the car on more for him and just see what happens. Hopefully this car does good because the only thing I have good for right now is that it kind of rained all day so the ground's a little bit wet which helps me out because I only make about like 190 horsepower, not too much. But if the car looks good, I might consider it turboing the car faster so I could actually go drift the car with AC on and maybe right hand drive. Yeah, tools back here and her first drift event. You excited? Huh, mama? Say hi. I know someone's gonna say it, but yeah, I do have a fucking Christmas tree in my car. But it still runs really good. And we just hydroplane. So. Yeah, this thing is giving me big FC vibes. I'm gonna literally pack up the FC, head to the track, drive it there, drive it back. Yeah, I mean, I know the RC is stock, but still, it just feels good to like basically like to get out, get out of the house, go spend some tires. And uh, who knows, maybe I'll buy another FC pretty soon. Guys, they need five more merch and I'll buy another FC. Letting the car cool down, I already went through a set of tires. I got too greedy, then let the tires cool down. What are you doing? So I let the car, 
I didn't let the tires cool down, so I overheated them, popped them after like five laps. So now I have no tires. I just have the ones that came in that I'm trying to decide whether I should just do one more lap or two and pop them or just basically pack up and go home. Now that it's dark out, I kind of want to go out again because it's going to throw a lot more fireballs. And because I'm getting comfortable with the car, the only thing I have to do, like the first lap I went out in the skip pad, uh, I thought it was gonna be like basically slicker, so I didn't throw it as hard as I did in the oval. And I kind of gripped up pretty hard, but I, I kind of caught it and, and then just kicked it again. So I just wanna go out one more time and uh, throw, it, throw it really hard and see what it does. Just gonna uh, cool down, eat some snacks, drink some water, and then go back onto the track. You want to drive again or go home? Alright, one more lap it is. to go home but getting somebody jump in the car because this car's running really good right now so got my helmet gonna do one last lap and then head home with the baby <laughs> I know you guys aren't gonna credit the RX8 that much because it's all stock, but this is a beast. Literally drove it home with no tires all around. That one's not that bad. This one right here though, this one right here is pretty bad. But we're close to the house, so I'm gonna put a little bit of gas in this thing because it's completely empty and make it home, park it, Get some new tires and go back to being a daily. I'm surprised by this car a lot. Uh, I was not expecting it to take the oval on that hard. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool experience. But, I think it's a daily. It's not a drift car. So, nah, I'm probably not going to drift it ever again. Because that's a lot of camber. But, it was just fun to just try the car out. See what it would do. So, don't sleep on Sock RX-8. Knuckles, coilovers. That's all it needs. <laughs> 